Good support in the stands as Aline shared their sports day with CP. We go right into the 400s. The under-15 girls head down the back stretch with it pretty much being anyone's race. Into the final 200 and the Maya London changed gears and surged to the front, just creating the distance with her and the rest of the runners. And as she got to the 100 mark, the revs went up a notch again. She was not playing. Almost in an all-out sprint now, her teammate Nikki Crony was also going well. This would be Allen House dominating. London over the line in 59.98 seconds and Crony 1 minute 02.73. Time now for Cumberbatch House to get in on the winning ways, but it did not come without a fight, as Azari Edie in the yellow and Shadon Prescott Henry in the red turned it on from the 200 meter mark. Considering they had conquered just over 300 meters, they already had a lot in the tank. As Edie glanced over his shoulder and made up his mind, there and then the race would be his. He had time to even jog at his opponents, but time to refocus with victory in sight as he goes on to win in 56.81 seconds and then cruising in almost side by side is Haynes Houses, Prescott Henry and Renico Blenman King. And every school has their star athlete. Ali Schools is a Naya nurse. Already a crypto qualifier in the under 17 girls 400, you could say this script was written before the gun went. And she looks so comfortable to take it in 58.23 seconds. Second was Kenya Hines and third, Kanita Walcott. The under 17 boys race brought some excitement as it was a battle royale between Kristen Nurse and Amari Brown. Brown, the tall of the two in the yellow shirt, looked like he was baiting the time to make his move. And he does so just as he approached the 100 mark. But both boys came off the bench flying. It was Brown who was able to find the edge and keep it that way. Looking cool as a cucumber. Doing it in 52.42 seconds. Nurse 53.89 and third was Rivaldo Brown. Just four girls featured in the under 20 girls 400 and going down the back stretch, the position started to take shape with Zaria Price leading the way. She looks strong at this point for her teammate Kanisha Gerard Harris behind her, but slowing a bit. But Price was smooth and steady to the task. So fast forward to the final phases, it was a clear cut finish. Price easing home in 1 minute 09.40 seconds. Combat House picks up those maximum points. So to second place, thanks to Jaredon Harris. And in for third was Michaela Sukbio Mears. And the under 20 boys race also saw a dominant run from Kemali Maynard, who came off the final bend in command. The rest of the field started to close in on him, but though visibly tired and glancing over to see he could keep the edge, the under 20 boys race was all his. 52.89 seconds was his time. Second was Shaquan Weeks, 54.64. And third, Marco Allen, 56.47. And as the shirt suggests, Allen must now go into BSAC, looking to be always achieving, always on the attack. Anne-Marie Burke, CBC Sports.